Welcome to this week's Power of Possible, brought to you by Yukon Health. I had been feeling that pain for three weeks, and it had gotten really bad. I went to some other facilities seeking help. They didn't find anything, except I was full of poop and gave me a laxative and sent me home. And then I ended up here. So when I first met Bonnie, she was a patient in the intensive care unit. She had been admitted the night before with what was believed to be a diverticular abscess. As soon as we recognized that her condition was deteriorating, she needed emergency surgery. She was found to have a freely perforated large intestine with spillage of intestinal contents with inside of her abdomen. So the conversation I had with her husband at the time is there's a very high chance that Bonnie wouldn't survive. And my belief is by faith and grace, he saved my life with his skills. If she hadn't received appropriate surgical care at the time that she did, she wouldn't be with us today. I'm grateful to be above ground. That's what I'm grateful for. Because, um, you know, I was told I could have passed on. Without the strong support of all of the staff in the hospital, Bonnie may not have had such a positive result. Anybody else get an abscess or whatever, go to UConn. They'll help you. Ask for Dr. Millay.